Hello, uh, I've been asked a few times how to add images to your slide in uh, the Blackboard uh, and in this video I will explain how to do so. So, uh, currently there are two ways to add images to your slide. Uh, first one is based on the little i command and this is a command which embeds SVG images which you pre-upload to your Dropbox account. Okay, so here's my Dropbox account, and here I intentionally pre upload it into my Blackboard 2 app folder. I pre uploaded a few images. I pre uploaded uh, this image, which is a slide SVG, and this image, which is a trick circle SVGs. These images I created beforehand, that's the image of a trigonometric circle, which I use often in my lectures, so I keep it ready to be embedded into my slides. And the other slide, which I, the other the other SVG image which I prepared for you is this one slide, one slide of a lecture or presentation which has been put together in a popular Beamer LaTeX package. Okay. Both of these SVG images, which are now hosted on my Dropbox account, I can embed them into my Blackboard slide in here. If I use this I key, look at this, if I hit little i, a window comes up which asks for the file to be embedded. If I put here tree circle and I can drop the SVG extension, that will preload this SVG image into my slide. I can use the plus minus keys to uh, magnify or to zoom in or zoom out this image or zoom, out, uh, or zoom in so I can choose the size which suits my presentation or my slide. Again the same the same can be done about the second image there so if I can, if I, can I, I hit the I key little i and now I say, I say slide that will preload the slide from the presentation put together in a Beamer. You can use this technique to reuse your existing slides in a Blackboard. You can preload the SVG images of these slides and then you can actually do extra commenting on here. Uh, this is a very important formula. For uh, and you can use the math here as well. You can say SF of T of T of T of T equals integral 0, 1 trace G of T T G of T T T and now I can actually increase the size of these brackets to make it look nicer. See, I just duplicated this formula already in Blackboard slide. DT. And that's how you can embed images, SVG images hosted on your Dropbox. That's one way to do it. The other way to embed images is the the other way to embed images is a capital I command. This is a command which embeds links, which embeds any images which can be accessible through a link on the net. For instance, if you open Google and if you take this location of the Google brand image and you do capital I and insert this in here, that will load the Google image. Into the, black, into the Blackboard software. The most often use of this feature, of the capital I feature, which embeds images through links, is the usage of graphs built in GeoGebra. Because if you build a graph here, here you see I built the graph of a sine function, then I got the x equal pi and 4 point, and I ran the tangent for this point, and now I would like to take this picture and 
move it into the Blackboard presentation. All you do, you engage the export image command. And then on this image, you copy the location of this image. The good news about this location is that it's the self-sufficient location. If you hit now the capital I letter and copy this location here, you will see a lot of encoding. And that's actually the entire content of your image is encoded in one address. You do that, and that's your sign function from the GeoGebra. Again, you can increase the size, decrease the size to your liking, and use this on your Blackboard slide.